Christian Harris of Hot Property Online. Thank you for watching. Folks, this week we're talking about pre-approvals and there's been a commercial out by one of the big banks, I'm not going to tell you who, uh, the last two digits in their name may sound like a province out west, BC, um, but one of the banks is advertising, uh, it's so simple to get pre-approved online. You can do it when you, before you go to bed, you can do it when you're uh, bathing your dog, you can do it when you're making uh, dinner. Um, and they're making it seem that it's so simple to get pre-approved online. Folks, please do not fall for this. Uh, we had an example of uh, someone last week in our office with one of our agents. The clients were pre-approved by the bank and they purchased and they found out that they got turned down for two reasons. A, they were putting less than 20% down, so the bank didn't have the final say. CMHC had the final say. Uh, B, when they did this pre-approval online, there was a section that said, what is the household income? And these people put down what their household income is, what they're bringing into the house as far as income. When the bank looked at it, they determined that not all the income was usable because some of the household income was actually a cash component that they did on the side. Not a lot, but enough to throw the ratios out. So what the clients thought was their household income is not didn't meet or match the underwriting guidelines of the bank. So when I hear the get pre-approved online, it's so easy, quick and easy. Quick and easy is not the right way to get uh, pre-approved. Okay, anything that's quick and easy is probably not done right. Uh, our pre-approvals, we send them to a lender. If a client wants to be pre-approved, they are fully underwritten by an institution and they then produce a certificate. Most institutions give you a piece of paper and the pre-approval is not worth the paper it's written on. So when you hear those commercials, how easy it is and little penguins walking around getting pre-approved online or having, a, having dinner getting pre-approved, Please don't fall for it because you need in this market to know that you're ready to go to make a, a good offer, a firm offer, probably with no conditions. And the last thing you need is telling, having your banker say, sorry, I know we gave you a pre-approval certificate online, but it's no longer valid. You don't get the house. So please give us a call and we'll help you out. Thank you.